Ah. Ciara's feet ached. Her back was stiff, and the headache she'd staved off with some ibuprofen four hours ago was rapidly creeping back behind her left eyeball. Nothing like the sweet pains of victory. One more commission like this, and she could afford to take that beach vacation she'd been promising Wesley for the past three years. Oh, Sarah, there you are, the bride's mother, who was reason number one, two, three, and forty-three for set headache, waved her over. Mother of the bridezilla paid the bills, so Ciara pasted on her most helpful smile and greeted the table. Hello, everyone. Having a nice time? Headache mom turned to the couple sitting next to her. Bill, the, this is Sarah, the wedding planner. You simply must book her for your Lynn's wedding. She is the best, always available for her clients. I called her last week at two in the morning when I simply knew that Bethany needed to have three more wedding cakes at the reception. Sarah never says no. Oh, great. That's what she wanted to be known for, being the slut of the wedding planner world. Well, I like to hear that. We want our baby to have everything she wants for her wedding. No expense spared. Do you have a card, Sarah? It's Ciara, actually. And yes, of course. She handed Bill, who she could already tell was wrapped around his daughter's little finger, a card. Bill handed the card to his wife. Let me write your time and date on the back for you. She pulled a pen out of her kit. Always prepared, true to her Girl Scout roots. She scribbled on the back of the card. Ciara Mosley Willingham. Do you own Willingham weddings, dear? Sigh, not yet. Not ever if her mother had anything to do with it. That honor goes to my mother, Wilhelmina. Ah, I see. Well, nepotism has its benefits. The table all chuckled at Bill's little joke. Benefits, schmenefits. If only they knew. I've got an appointment that just opened up for two weeks from Monday. Will that work to bring Lynn in for a consultation? Two weeks? She nodded. I'm afraid the next available is in August. The couple glanced at each other. They were not used to waiting, patiently. Most of her clients weren't. That's almost three months from now. Headache mother raised a glass of champagne. You wanted the best. Better get her while you can. Thee raised an eyebrow, trying to intimidate Ciara. Not gonna happen. Ciara gave the mother her award-winning account-getting smile. Thee gave in.